Good morning to you. It must be 5 a.m. on the East Coast because it's time for Hardison's Tips with your host, Brandon Hardison, on this outstanding September 9th of the year 2020. So for all of you great brothers and sisters in the sales field, whether it's key account, major account, up and down the street, in home sales, retail in general, but automotive more exclusively, we have some information for you. So we're just going to get right to it because you need to get to work. On one of the other previous broadcasts, we were talking about social media tips for car salespeople what you need to do in today's world to ensure your long-term success. So I'm just going to pick up from there. And there's certain things where I left off that we need to be doing every day. And there are five things that we need to really focus in on. And here's why. There's a lot of downtime on the sales floor. We have to admit it. Make sure you use your time by committing to do these five things every day that will further your value with potential customers' prospects. Here's some examples. Like a post, uh, sharing something newsworthy, commenting on a previous posts, yours or someone else's, wishing somebody a happy birthday, happy anniversary that you connect with, polish up a story or an image. People love to hear stories from professionals in their field. Follow an influencer and comment on their post. How about Googling yourself? When was the last time you Googled yourself and then take action on what you see or what you don't see? Now, I'm not going to go over that again, but that's the power. Google yourself. Write an article on your blog, Facebook, LinkedIn. As for reviews, you see, when we do things like this, we start to separate ourselves and remember. What can we do during this pandemic where we still can shine in the customer's eyes? If we can find a way to stay in touch with our existing clients, colleagues, and other professionals that we know in real life, they are going to look at it as meaningful, not just you chasing for another lead. And when you have meaningful connections, the better they are, the more they're going to share with their people. People you've met already or you know in person are ideal to connect with on social media. The old bird dog effect, they're so much more likely for them because they know you to engage with you and share that with some of their friends and family members that you do not. How about creating an introduction video? One of the best social selling tips that I can recommend is to introduce yourself to your customers. So imagine you have 15 seconds to record a video and explain to your customers who you are and how you can help them. To some, I know it may seem like a big challenge to raise someone's interest in just 15 seconds. Uh, but that really can't be effective. Well, when replying to a customer's email or social media, all you need to do is present that they are right in front of you and speak naturally. You don't have to give them war and peace. It's ideal to record the video for each specific customer, mentioning their name, and the chances are pretty good that you'll get a positive reaction from that short little 15 seconds that you did send. How about joining groups? 
participating and engaging in different groups that are on any one of those platforms from Facebook to LinkedIn groups, you can share your valuable expertise and how you can help them. Some of the best conversations and connections happen in the LinkedIn industry for specific groups. You need to check it out. How about asking for referrals and testimonials? Ah, I really don't care to do that type of follow-up. Well, don't follow up when they're gone. Talk to them while they're in front of you. Ask for reviews, ask for testimonials. A regular stream of good people will always get you there. Now, keep in mind that when you do these things, you need to be prepared. Hopefully you are practicing. So while you're practicing, I ask you to do this last thing. Make a powerful testimonial video that you can use in pretty much any situation. By doing some of these things will set you apart immediately to that guest that you're trying to sell to. Also to other people who watch on these social sites. And that's what we're trying to do, raise our presence on the social sites. Once again, Brandon Hardison for Champion Strategies and Hardison's Tips. And don't forget it's Wednesday. So Hardison's Tips Live will be at 12 noon. Our special guest today is Anthony Alcarona. He is a specialist when it comes to the BDC space. So you don't want to miss out on that. 12 o'clock Eastern Standard Time today, Wednesday, September the 9th. And as always in parting, please remember, go out and make it a champion day.